Let's do this, Vegeta! This is the perfect location. Wouldn't you agree, Kakarot? I don't want to take damage and give Majin Buu more energy. So I'm going full force and ending this right away. Very good. I'm quite eager to see just how hard you've been training in Otherworld. <laughs> Impressive. You're even more powerful than Gohan was back then. <laughs> this might take longer than I thought. and not be ruled by foolish emotions. I grew to hate myself. Before I realized it, I, I'd become soft, like all of you. I, of all people, came to have a family, and it actually felt good. I'd also grown comfortable living here on Earth and all that it included. And, and that's why, that's why I needed to return to my villainous self. And now that I have, I feel absolutely wonderful. Do you really?
Well, Deborah, are you confident you have what it takes to defeat that earthling? Of course. I will have no trouble at all exterminating that trash. Hmm? Ah? Huh? that energy come from? That's right. Vegeta and my dad are both fighting at a level beyond Super Saiyan. Oh, the damage they're each taking must be massive. He, he's coming out! Martin Buu's coming out! Well, with him at full power now, then... Might as well try to do what I can to stop him. Ha! Majin Boom at his end with that last attack. I'll hold Bobbity at bay. Gohan, you take care of Dabura. Once we've done that, we'll have finally put an end to Bobbity's evil plan. I... I can feel an incredible key. It, it's swelling up. It's... Huh? the smoke that came out of the ball earlier. <clears throat> A cloud? No! It's the smoke from before! Uh, uh, what is that? That thing, Majin Buu? Yes, I could never forget that, that menacing face. <laughs> so it is Majin Buu then. That's Majin Buu? <laughs> Hi there, Majin Buu. I'm Bobbity, the son of your creator, Bibbidi. You've been sealed in that ball for a very long time, but I've gotten you out. I am your new master. Hey, hey, what are you doing? I'm your master. Don't you ignore me. <laughs> what a buffoon. I'm not exactly sure what happened, but it seems we have failed. After all that trouble, we have nothing but this powerless sack of fat to show for it. <laughs> you want to challenge me, the great Deborah? The dreaded demon of destruction, Majin Buu. That 
was incredible! Very good, Majin Buu! His key... Majin Buu's key just skyrocketed. It's huge! He's too... He's too powerful. I don't believe this. This wasn't how things were supposed to go. I was confident we could defeat Bobbity and prevent Majin Buu's revival. If only... If only I had known from the beginning that you mortals could have achieved so much more power far beyond that of my own. We could have made use of that method. Huh? That, that method? What do you mean? Martin Boo! Listen to me, Martin Boo! Are you really sure you want to ignore me? I've read my father's notes. I know how to seal you back in that ball. <laughs> yes, yes, good. That's right. Listen, Martin Boo, here is your first order. I want you to kill those two over there. I don't know if I can win, but one thing's for sure. He can't be left alone. If he gets out of here, the body count could reach catastrophic levels. Unbelievable! Nothing's hurting him! You are Boo's way! You go bye-bye!
Hey, Trunks, which one's the Majin? It's me. I don't know any of these guys. Uh, uh. Oh, and Majin Buu, feel free to finish the Supreme Kai off. Lord Bobbity, this creature, Majin Buu, is not like the others. He will not serve you as your loyal servant. He must be eliminated immediately. Who gotta eat you? You insolent little... Turn into cookie! Magnificent! Very good, Martin Poo! <laughs> oh. Piccolo, what's going on? Oh, the spell's broken. <gasps> uh. Uh, what, uh, what are you two doing here? You guys, what are you doing here? Well, we were statues until just now. But it looks like that creep who spit on us died, and everyone's back to normal. <gasps> what is this unbelievable energy? No, no it, it can't be. Is that Majin Buu? Majin Buu, devour this fool as well. Okay, okay! Uh. Vegeta, who was empowered by Babidi's spell and more determined than ever, remained locked in fierce combat with Goku. In the midst of the battle, the two Saiyans began to sense a massive energy that suddenly appeared in the distance. Realizing the energy must belong to Majin Buu, Goku pleaded with Vegeta to stop the fight so they could focus on defeating the new threat. Vegeta knew Goku would no longer be able to concentrate on their battle, so he agreed, or so it seemed. It was just a lie to make Goku lower his guard. With Goku distracted, Vegeta knocked him unconscious. He then made his way to Majin Buu's location, ready to fight the menace he helped bring back into existence. Majin Buu's free because of me, so I'll be the one to get rid of him. I'll settle the score with you after that. That is, if I make it back alive. Right. Time to go meet this Majin Buu face to face. <laughs> Ooh, what is this power? 
Gohan's energy is already gone. Forgive me. This is my fault. That's it, huh? I might as well destroy it while I can. My, 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 my ship! Oh, blast it! What in the world is going on? Hey there! Uh, Vegeta, what have you done? I don't recall telling you to destroy my ship! So that fat bastard with the ugly mug is Majin Buu, huh? You... You killed Gohan, didn't you? <gasps> Gohan! Ugly mug? What's that? It means he thinks you have a strange face. <gasps> now Boo angry! I'm not going to hell on my own. I'm taking you all with me! Majin Buu needs to be taken care of, but you're the real cause behind all this, Bobbity. This... this can be! your mom for me what are you talking about dad what do you mean take good care of mom you need to get as far away from here as you can i'm going to fight majin buu on my own N no way we're gonna fight too the three of us can take him down for sure trunks i haven't given you a single hug since the day you were born have i huh Come here, son. Uh... Dad? Uh... Uh... uh, uh what are you doing, Dad? Cut it out! You're embarrassing me! <laughs> Take care, Trunks. Huh? Ah! Uh. <sighs> Why'd you... Why'd you do that? Why'd you hit Trunks?
Take these two as far away from here as you can. I'm counting on you, Piccolo. You're prepared to die, aren't you? Just tell me one thing. If I die, will I be able to see Kakarot in the other world? I'm afraid not. You've killed too many innocent people. When you die, you'll lose your body, and your soul will be carried off to a different world. I see. That's too bad. Now, get out of here. Hurry! Wait, Majin Buu! You're going to have to defeat me first! You got that? Fight me, you brain-dead balloon! Um, you say mean thing, even though you're weak! I finally know how to get rid of you. Once and for all. Hey! What in the world is Vegeta doing? He's gonna get himself killed! For the first time ever, he's finally fighting to protect someone other than himself. Throwing his life away to do it. To make sure you can't put yourself back together, I'm going to blow you into microscopic pieces! Here, take these two. I'm going to see what happened. Uh, okay. I see. So if Majin Buu only takes a small amount of damage, his cells can regenerate. To prevent that, Vegeta sacrificed himself to blow Majin Buu into a trillion pieces. We were saved by him, of all people. <laughs> Bobbity, you're still alive. Guess I'll have to fix that. Tell me, Majin Buu's fragments, they're... Majin Buu is still alive! To seal you up again? Yeah! Ooh, ooh, good! Well done, Majin Buu! That green fool and 
those two runts have messed with me for the last time. They will learn to fear the great Barbity and Martin Boo! Reduce this planet to a desolate hellscape, Margin Boo! Kill as many of the Earthlings as it takes to flush those Cretans out of hiding! He's not dead? Margin Boo's not dead? Uh, no way! Vegeta sacrificed himself for nothing? It's not safe here on the surface. Get the kids and everyone else to Kami's lookout, right now! These two are the planet's last chance, as slim as it may be. I can sense Majin Buu's energy, but I can't sense Vegeta's anywhere. Uh, don't tell me. Vegeta couldn't have gotten himself killed. Oh no. I don't sense Gohan's energy either. What's going on? Hmm? Piccolo and Krillin are both alive. They aren't stone anymore. Okay. They should know what's going on. I'd bet on that. Where would they be? Akami's lookout, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> 